it is a disease that epitomizes a health issue that is predominantly among people of African descent. And this is simply because uh, the disease has arisen uh, because if you have a gene that uh, leads to the disease, you are more resilient against malaria. And so in areas of the world where malaria is endemic, uh, the sickle cell gene is predominant. And as a result, sickle cell disease, which means you have a double copy of the gene, is more prevalent among people of black descent. So we all have in our bodies um, a protein called hemoglobin. That's what makes our blood look red. And its primary purpose is to carry oxygen, which is an essential sort of uh, energy source for all the cells to thrive. Mm -hmm. Now, in sickle cell, the protein is mutated. And when it gives away the oxygen, instead of remaining in the solution, it, it forms a gel. And that leads to distortion of the red cell, which normally should be donut shaped into a circle. A circle is a farm tool that looks like a crescent. Yes. And it is that abnormal shape of a circle, that distortion, that gives the disease its name. Now that distortion leads to early breakage of the cell. So the, 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 the membrane or the covering of the cell becomes more rigid, mm -hmm. easily breakable. Mm -hmm. And not only that, it is sticky to the, to the lining of the blood vessels. So they are more likely to get clogged during blood flow. And this can lead to starvation of oxygen to the tissues. So you will know that people with sickle cell disease are susceptible to having intense pain. And it's a starvation of oxygen supply to the bone that leads to this excruciating pain. But you can imagine that if it affects blood vessels, it means that it can affect virtually every organ. Right. So people with sickle cell disease are at risk of damage to the brain, to the kidneys, to the heart. All these organs are susceptible. And that is why if you don't treat them, their longevity is shortened and they face very, very um, poor quality life. But now there are effective treatments that are available, which is extending their lives mm -hmm. and giving them better quality of care. So although it's a blood disease, mm -hmm. its manifestations can affect virtually every organ. Um.